The following is a class given by His Holiness Jaya Pataka Swami Maharaj on June 22nd, 1981 in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Part 2 Each person has got his service and we're trying to do, and that's also a type of competition, who can serve Krishna the most. But the overall intention is Krishna's pleasure. So if someone else is successful in preaching, that's also our joy. If someone else is unsuccessful, has some difficulty, that's our sadness. Because we know that this is going to make Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, previous Acharyas, Srila Prabhupada, happy, or it's going to make them also feel some uh, discomfort. So because we're all serving the same ultimate master, the same previous acharyas, so in this way automatically a type of a cooperative spirit grows. You see. Even if some misunderstanding comes up, then that may also, that's only temporary, and that by discussion, by association with Vaishnavas, by Ishta Goshti, that thing will also be destroyed. That is just some temporary type of superficial due to lack of such type of communication and understanding. Uh, this Krishna conscious movement has got so many wonderful devotees as I travel around, not only the Acharyas and GBCs members who are, of course, were private secretaries and associates of Prabhupada, but temple presidents, book distributors, pujaris, so many uh, devotees around the movement. They're very wonderful, sincere devotees who are who are very attached to serving Krishna and the Acharyas, uh, previous Acharyas. And uh, one sees that this movement is actually an ocean of very great souls who are dedicated to doing welfare work for the whole human society, for the whole uh, universe. So they are very dear to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. So when one gradually sees that how it is not that only in our temple there are some good devotees, but there are good devotees in every temple, and that they are very sincere devotees. So we can see that actually they are very dear to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And if we can encourage them in their service to Lord Chaitanya, uh, in the service to their spiritual master, that this will be pleasing to Lord Chaitanya Nityananda. And then actually a whole type of a cooperative spirit, how we can encourage everyone in their devotional service. So when somehow someone is discouraged, that's of course very sad. And so then we try to make a program that a person may again be encouraged. It's just basically communication known as ishtagoshti and consideration and appreciation of the good qualities of other Vaishnavas. And this creates that type of cooperative spirit. If we lose sight that our spiritual master is the servant of our, just like our spiritual master servant of Prabhupada or Bhakti Siddhanta. And this way then one sees that how there's a whole chain of spiritual masters, that there's a whole family. So one thing equal to, two things equal to the same thing are equal to each other. As long as everyone is trying to serve Lord Chaitanya sincerely, so that means that they're all equal. Because they're equal with Chaitanya's mission, therefore they're equal with each other. And this way then a cooperative spirit is there. So of course each person pushes on with his own service. But then appreciates that others are also in this way a total, you see, upward push to give everything back to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu to, is created. And just like when the 10,000 brothers, the Prachetas, they were all worshipping underwater for so many thousands of years, and Vishnu appeared and said, because you cooperated together, this has given me a special satisfaction. Therefore, I'm personally appearing before you. So, that's something that Lord Chaitanya likes very much when so many devotees cooperate together. There was a big festival when all the devotees came about 50 years after Lord Chaitanya left. And they had a big Sankirtan and they had a, a Abhishek of a deity at Gaur Purnima. This is in a village called Keturi. Janava Devi, the daughter of 
I'm the son of, uh, excuse me, wife of Nityananda. She was present. Achutananda, the son of Advaita. There were so many were there. Narottam, Srinivas, Shamananda, they're all present. In the middle of a kirtan led by Narottam, Lord Chaitanya appeared with Nityananda, with all the associates, although they'd all disappeared maybe 50 years ago or so. They all reappeared and they were present and the devotees were, um, they were everyone was seeing Lord Chaitanya. Advaita grabbed Achutananda's son, they were dancing. And there was a big reunion that of those who had all, even disciples of disciples who hadn't been born even when Lord Chaitanya was there, they were able to see personally Chaitanya Mahaprabhu dancing. See, because he was so pleased that they'd all come together and were worshipping him in this way cooperatively, he personally appeared amongst them. Then again he disappeared and they were <laughs> and thrown in separation. <coughs> so, we can even hope that uh, sometime we may be able to see Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, see Prabhupada, even if we didn't have that opportunity up to now, even though he's gone, it, it's not material, he may also appear uh, before us. And of course he's present in our temples, in our worship, in our service, the Lord is there. But we may even see him you see, with divine eyes, by His mercy. That also is not impossible. Nothing is impossible. We will see Him, of course, if not, if not sooner, at least when we leave this body. We will see Him when we are serving our whole life. That is guaranteed. So when we understand all this, we have a broader vision. It's, it's only when our vision is, becomes narrowed due to so many considerations which are really temporary then we start to see things in a different way. If we see in a very broad, Prabhupada once told me, you have to broaden your vision, broaden, wide. And he just said it in such a way that I felt, though, I'm just looking with a tunnel vision. You see, when I'm Prabhupada is seeing so broad, and no matter how high, much I try to broaden, I can see that still it's only a tunnel compared to what Prabhupada is seeing. The whole broad vision of that every man, woman, and child, the whole world, town and village, they all can become devotees of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. They can all be engaged in different ways through prasadam or through kirtan or through book distribution. Be connected with Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. As they, again, even if they don't go back in this life, when they're reborn, the next time they'll be closer and closer to Chaitanya's movement. You know. So, gradually we pray that our vision can be broadened. We become Mahatmas to realize our Ins insignificant part in Lord Chaitanya's movement has got in its own right so much significance, so much importance for ourselves and for others who we are preaching to. And this way we can be the instrument in the hand of Mahaprabhu. So this cooperative spirit comes as we become more mature in our outlook and we see things in that type of viewpoint. So what happens is that it's like if you have a rotten apple, right? And you keep it in the basket, then it rots the other apples. You have a bad thought or you have some doubt, you keep it inside without bringing it out, then it starts to pollute the consciousness. So that's why we try, we, devotees should, one of the six things is follow the footsteps of the previous acharyas to be straightforward. You see, one should open up and uh, reveal at least to the to the spiritual master and to such very advanced devotees to whom the one can uh, trust to give a scriptural answer. And this way, then uh, these difficulties can be brought out. If one keeps it inside, then that will remain as a type of uh, festering sore. I know that Srila... Uh, Hansa Duda Swami, he always very straightforward. Whatever is on his mind, he says it. He's very sincere in that way. You see. So, in this way, we should follow the footsteps of great devotees. If we have something in our mind, then we can say that, and that can be purified. Because of lack of such communication, then one doubts and mistrusts others, and then it, it creates a whole type of... Uh, different mood, which is not conducive to devotional service. So that's why some people, they'll advance faster. And those who are more complex, they're not so just simple devotees, then it may take some longer. 
Like some people come here, but they say so many things. They always, well, I think, I think it should be like that. I, and they try to put so many ideas, right? So you know they're not making much advancement because they're not listening. They, they're not listening. It doesn't enter in their brain. They're already thinking so many things. They hear something, then they speculate on it, make some other proposal. So although they're coming, it's like very slow. And someone who is hearing and they're actually opening and letting it come in their heart and then they're trying to understand it. If there's still some doubt, they ask question and get it cleared up. In this way, gradually they're maturing more and more and they're making advancement. So that's the way of actually understanding, not by just a challenging mood, but with an idea that I want to understand. And if there's something I can't accept or I can't fully understand why that should be, then we again ask questions. But those you can see who are not so simple, that even though they're coming, you know, it's very slow. Right? There's a few people like that here. So that's there amongst Indian people. They, they, they tend to sometimes have that. You see, uh, probably because they're, by nature, is very simple. And sometimes when you, if you open up to someone, they, they exploit you. You see. They exploit. So one has to have that faith. But of, of course, within class or within Istagoshi, there should be no worry about that. Yeah, that, that's dangerous. That's like Istagoshi has to be kept amongst uh, Krishna conscious, more advanced people. Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna Krishna Hare 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 Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna H